Hi everyone, it's chi -Town Tracy. I just quickly wanted to show you what I just did my first pocket page. I'm so excited. And I did it for a challenge. And it's for a lady that I, I met on Facebook and she lives in Greece. And she's having a challenge and I'll link her challenge. And I think this is like the perfect thing to send somebody who is overseas. So um, again, I, if you want a maybe I don't know if she knows about these, but she can. Maybe she'll send one back. Who knows? But anyway, so I just want to quickly show you this, and then um, I have to come back in a little while and show you what's new at Art Attack. But I used the Floral Pavilion, which I sell in the store. I love these papers. They're designed um, by first. They're by first edition, but designed by Tanya Whalen, which I think are awesome. Tanya Whalen makes that Tilda, Tilda S fabric that everybody loves. So there's um, the floral. And then there's the Bella Rose. And I have both of these in the store right now. I love them both. And then I use the Ultimate, Ult, Ultimate, the Ultra Pro Nine Pocket Pages. These are, I bought them at Walmart, but I also will sell some of these in the store. I'll probably have them in about a week. So this is what I came up with. Can you guys see that? So here I just used a die that I had that um, I, I might still have this in the store, I don't know, but it makes these tiny little dresses so cute. And this is, uh, again, all these papers are from first edition, either Bella Rose or, or Flora Pavilion. I think most of them might be Flora Pavilion. And this is um, some felt like lace from Daiso. Can you see that? And um, these are just Prima stickers. And this is some... Um, what do you call it? It's just like some crocheted lace, but it's got a sticky back. So kind of like fabric tape. And this was gifted to me. And I don't remember who made this for me, but um, that was gifted. And then I just put a little belt, a button and some embroidery thread. And I made a bunch of these last week and I used a doily in the back. And then um, the um, images I got on Etsy and then, the you know, I just painted the um, bottle caps and add seam binding. And here, this was also gifted to me. And I can't tell you who gifted to me because I looked in the back and it would, there wasn't a name. So, and then I just used a little doily. And these are from the dollar, I don't know if they're from the dollar store or Michael's. Um, but I just thought it was cute with a little red ribbon because with a little red rhinestone. I love this paper. Um, this was in time, this is Tanya Whalen, and this is the little. Well, I can, should show you guys something in a minute. And this is the the um, just little heart cutouts that I had, you know, punch. And um, I wanted to show you something I made with this or something very similar. I have to show you. I love it. And I just to sh just remind you, it's sitting right here. But anyway, so this is just a quote that I copied from the internet. It says, "I just want to make beautiful things, even if no one cares." And I thought that was really cute. And I did do some sewing on some of them. But I did it in pink and you can't really see it. And this is one of those um, chalkboard chalkboard tags that you that I got on sale at Michael's. And I just added some rickrack and a little bow. And then I changed the, the, the twine out with ribbon. Um, and I just put in my chalkboard marker that I absolutely love. The Hampton Art Chalkboard. I think I have one of these left in the store. Absolutely love this. And I was able to write on this. And it just looks adorable because you can write, you know, pretty small in chalk. If you used a big piece of chalk, you could never get that to look like that. So I just thought that was really cute. And this is where I'll put some, just some little facts about me in the back. You know, like um, that I'm a mom, I have a boy and a girl, their ages maybe, and just real basic. I'm kind of nervous about writing the letter, um, but I will put a letter in here because like I said, she's from Greece and I wanted to little, know a little bit more about me. So I just put some Joanne's buttons down here and these are from Michael's, um, you know, dollar bins or dollar fifty bins and some more Rick Rack. Absolutely love this washi tape from Michael's. I think it's a new one. Oh my God, it's so Tilda love 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 and it comes with pink and this is new at michael's so i just put some washi on this and then added some appliques and i gosh who did i get these appliques from 
These were gifted to me. Oh, I can't remember. But I just thought it was really cute. I did add some stuff in the back since it's a, kind of like a challenge. You can send anything you want. So I just added some stuff in the back. Some, you know, a resin piece, some um, sentiments. And I'll put my about me and my letter back here. And this is not going, but I don't have any other tea. And I just wanted to see if it, this is actually gifted to me by Gloria. She told me it's really good and I've never tried it. So, but it's not going. I'm going to go buy some tea in a few minutes. Um, buy my daughter a shamrock shake at McDonald's. So we're going to go stop at World Market and get some tea. So I put some bottle caps and then I put, you know, um, some little um, images for the bottle caps in there. And um, so that and some flowers from Michael's just so I could get, get a few more gifts in here. But it's still light enough where it probably won't cost me too much to send it to Greece. Um, oh, and these are tilde, uh, tilde pins in here. So I hope you like my first um, pocket page or pocket letter or however you want to call it. It's super cute and I'd love to make more. I've got all these beautiful papers that are coming in um, with the golds and I'm dying to make one like that. So if you guys want to trade one of these, let me know. I do need a lot of time because I've got so many things going on, but they don't take that long. But if you guys want to swap, excuse me, pocket pages, let me know. And thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.